Greetings, fellow Dallas Cowboys enthusiasts. Thank you for tuning in and subscribing. Unfortunately, it seems that Dallas won't be signing Hopkins, so we can let go of that possibility. As we assess the Cowboys' depth chart for this offseason, the question arises. Who will impress during the summer and secure the fourth spot come September? The top contenders appear to be Simi Fihoko, Jalen Tolbert, and Dennis Houston. These three individuals are currently the main options the team has to work with as the new season approaches. Last season, Houston began the campaign as the third-choice receiver behind C.D. Lamb and Noah Brown for the first two weeks. During those two games, he made two catches for a total of 16 yards. Fihoko played in five games, securing three receptions for 24 yards, while Tolbert faced difficulties from the start. He only appeared in eight games, catching two passes for 12 yards, and often found himself benched. The reasons behind Tolbert's struggles last year remain a mystery. Many of us believe that perhaps he struggled to transition from college to the NFL, which is a fair assessment. However, we never received an explanation for his lack of progress. As of May 2023, I am still trying to understand what happened. As of May 31st, these three individuals mentioned earlier seem to be the strongest contenders for the fourth wide receiver position. However, it's worth noting that all three players could still see playing time in different packages and roles, even if they don't secure the specific fourth wide out spot. I still believe that many people underestimate the significant impact of acquiring Brandon Cooks through a trade. He consistently performs at a high level wherever he goes. Additionally, Michael Gallup has returned from injury and claims to feel back to his former self. It's remarkable how much things have changed in just one year. The situation became so dire that the team had to sign T.Y. Hilton, who quickly became the second-best receiver on the team after Lamb. If the team won 12 games last year, there's no reason why they can't achieve the same success again. Tony Pollard is on track to regain his explosive form, and we shouldn't overlook Deuce Vaughn either. I believe Vaughn will play a significant role in the passing game due to his explosive playing style. If Fihoko doesn't prove himself, then my bet is on Tolbert. Fihoko possesses an appealing combination of size and speed, but consistency remains a key area for improvement. All three players have something to prove and likely desire that spot in the rotation more than anyone else, because it's currently up for grabs. Although the Cowboys also have other players like Jalen Moreno-Cropper and Jalen Brooks, let's hold off on discussing them for now. Only time will tell. For now, let's appreciate the fact that our roster is in a much better position than it was last season. As a fellow Dallas fan, I would love to hear your thoughts on these three players. Feel free to leave your comments below. And before you go, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Goodbye, and until the next video.